the whole thing wobbing. Once again, have another double header Saturday. We have Ultimate Legends and Golden Tickets. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Ultra Vibes for being a part of the Noti Gang. If you guys want a chance to shout out the next video, drop a link in the vid. Make sure you guys are sub to the channel. Turn notification bell on and comment down below. Noti Gang. Also, guys, there is a Kyrie Irving 0.5 point special live on Underdog for everybody for tomorrow night's game. So if you sign up right now using code Zerk, you'll get up to $250 in bonus funds. You get this Kyrie 0.5 and you will get another 0.5 special to day if you sign up and of course today is also saturday which means we have ufc my ufc picks right now are posted up over on my twitter be on the lookout we might get a discount or some other special as well today i would not be surprised if you guys have not already checked out the giveaway link down below in the comment section we away five copies of an 150 dollars version of madden 25 and college ball 25 check that out all right guys so let's take a look at everything we have golden tickets we have ultimate legends and uh starting off we have asante samuel 98 speed 99 excel 5 foot 10 98 man 99 zone uh he does also have a 69 block shed nice 85 hit power 78 tackling in terms of abilities he has bottleneck for zero a lot of people have been running like bottlenecks out here so sure some people really like that reinforcement for one ap okay he gets tackle supreme for zero and one step ahead for zero per usual man these these uls like crazy we're talking two x factors you can put on them tackle supreme and also one step ahead in asante samuel that's just absolutely insane uh we also do have franco harris who has tip drill i'm guessing he has tip drill because of you know the immaculate reception uh he has 96 speed 95 strength 99 carrying 88 catch 92 run block trent williams is still probably the better card to put a fullback here to be honest with you uh but he does also have vanguard automatically equipped for zero ap freight train for one ap tank for zero backyard halfback jukebox and truss for one ap so there's franco harris i don't know exactly how expensive that card's gonna be but you know what we will uh see about that and then the final ultimate legend is johnny unitas 92 speed 99 throw power 97 98 and 99 for the accuracies as tank automatically for zero ap does get trust that's cool gunslinger for zero uh master tactician for one pass lead for one is awesome and then run and gun for zero ap obviously in terms of QBs, there's better options. And then taking a look at the golden tickets, guys. We have cornerback Joe Alt. This is probably gonna be my favorite one today. We'll see about the abilities though. Six foot eight, 322 pounds, 99 speed, 99 excel, 99 man, 99 zone. So many people have been rocking out with Joe Alt pretty much anywhere. Safety, outside corner, slot corner. Uh, this card's just crazy. 99 impact block, 99 block shed, 99 hit power, 94 tackling, 99 power move. It's a great, great card. Of course, he does get the charge up X factors. And then in terms of his other abilities though, medium route KO for one, one step ahead for one, deep zone KO, mid zone KO for zero, pick artist for zero, and flat zone KO for zero AP. So, I wish he had something better here, to be honest with you, for the 1 APs. I wish that he had, like, Tackle Supreme or Avalanche or, you know, Reinforcement because we could throw that on him. Reinforcement would have been super, super cool to see on the card. But, you know, one step ahead of you guys run man coverage, there you go. Yeah, uh, I, I just, I guess they didn't know you could do that for the 1 APs or, I don't know. Is what it is. Still a good card, but obviously would have been way better with like reinforcement in there for one AP. But Marshawn Lynch, 99 speed, 98 excel. Uh, also has 99 carry, 99 truck, 99 break tackle. He has a 99 juke move. Wait a second. Do they... Why does he have 99 impact block? Why does this card have 99 impact block, but they didn't boost his catching? Okay. Uh, abilities, I am concerned to see the least... Tank for one, backfield master for one, evasive for zero, energizer for zero, truss for zero, and freight train for zero? Okay. Now, it's not angry runs, right? But you can get angry runs for one AP. That is still pretty dope. Freight train for zero and truss for zero AP as well as evasive right there. The one APs, you know, tank and backfield masters, what it is. So in terms of like what do you put on him? Well, you obviously need to put evasive on him. After that, you could use freight train if you want to, or just go with anger runs for one AP and put Truzz on him for zero. That's pretty dope. So a lot of options on that card, that's for sure. Then we have TJ Watt, 99 speed, 99 excel, 99 block shed. I'm curious why they didn't boost the power move. It's only a 92. They just 
didn't choose to boost it for some reason. Uh, he has 90 zone and 98 hit power, 98 pursuits. I really couldn't tell you what they boosted instead of the uh, power move there. So, I don't know. Enforce Supreme for one, Edge Thunder Leaf for one AP, Lurk Arch zero, Avalanche zero, Mid Zone KO zero, Flat Zone KO zero. There's TJ Watt. And then we have RG3 as well. Uh, taking a look at his stats, he has 99 speed, 99 throw power, 97, 99, 99. Uh, obviously, again, because of the ability stacks and everything, he's not going to be as good as even like, you know, Lamar Jackson is what it is. Master Tactician for one, Evasive for one, Sefi lead for zero. They never, ever, actually, they explicitly said that you can't put Sefi lead for zero, I do believe. Roaming Deadeye for zero, Fearless for zero, and Trust. Okay, so RG3 gets Sefi lead and Truss for 0 AP, and you can put Master Tactician on him for 1. That's actually crazy. I'm telling you guys right now, I remember the form saying that you couldn't do set feet lead, passing elite, Master Tactician for 0 AP. So, hey, I guess EA decided with, you know, coming down to the end of the game to allow it on RG3. I'm not mad at it. So there we go. RG3, definitely a very, very usable card. Then we have the special offers, guys. Uh, this pack is terrible. This Ultimate Legend Fantasy Bundle, you get 291 pluses, right? Your choice of 1 and 291 pluses, 294 pluses, and then your choice of 1 and 297 pluses. Take a look at the odds, though, on a 99 overall. 9%? 9% EA. That is atrocious. Then we have the current release GT bundle. Uh, of course, for this, you know, 29%. And again, you know, I probably wouldn't normally open up this pack right here or wouldn't open it up, I should say, if I wasn't doing the content here. But yes, I'm going to open it up because I know you guys want to see me do it. So let's go ahead. Let's get into it. Let's see if we can pull another golden ticket today. We're going to open this up and then we'll get into some, uh, wow, 98 Zedarius. That's a good pull. Uh, we'll get into some other packs as well. Now you're seeing like 98 overall pulls. 97 trey hendrickson okay and we get a 95 jair that's more like it on to the either the golden ticket or the 98 ah a shame a uh a shame we did not pull a golden ticket we got joey porter all right, so let's open up some Ultimate Legend packs, guys. By the way, I've been saying it for like the last couple of weeks because I'm telling you, for the last couple of weeks, people have been tweeting me and saying, hey, I got my free UL today. And I think it was due to one of the solo challenges of Ultimate Legends. This was like back in the first like couple releases of ULs. Essentially, one of the first couple releases of ULs, we had like an issue with the solo that like wasn't giving out the token. And then EA eventually gave out the token as you get 98 D on right there. So I think it's people had like a little bit of a head start and they actually were able to get their ultimate legend for free back then but i've been saying that like the last couple weeks and i keep in the comments saying no it's next week whatever so officially okay according to all the comments that i've been getting this is the week that every single person out there should be able to go in and get their free ultimate legend player so make sure you guys do so go play the solo challenges get your tokens and don't tell me that you can't get your free UL this week. Because I know, I've been saying for the last two weeks, that people have been telling me they're getting their free ULs. This 100 million billion percent uh, should be a week where everyone can get there. So, go play the solos. Alright, so let's take a look here, guys. These Ultimate Legends in the Golden Tickets. I gotta say, in terms of the GTs, uh, RG3, awesome that EA actually made him better than, you know, was supposed to be allowed according to the form. Awesome with that. Could also be like an EA dev made one there. Uh, when it comes to uh, Asante Samuel right here, currently going for 769k. Johnny Unitas, 780k. And then, what is Franco? I really don't know. Oh, none pulled. Really? No, no Franco Harris pulls? That's interesting. It's uh, 1045, so it's been 15 minutes, and we don't have any Franco Harris's up on the auction house. Okay. I'm not going to say he's not in packs, but interesting that none have been pulled. And then uh, the GTs for today, in terms of their prices, what are we looking like here? Obviously, they just came out again, so they're going to be a little bit more expensive than they will settle at. TJ Watt, 1.8 mil. No. RG3, 
One of the best golden ticket QBs. That's awesome right there. Marshawn Lynch. I actually do like that card. It's pretty good. 2.2 mil. And then Joe Alt. Uh, again, you know, Joe Alt got like reinforcement for zero AP. That would be awesome. Or even one AP, whatever. That'd be super, super sick. But this is kind of just like a, a bit of a faster version of the other one, right? Of the other Joe Alt. So for the coins, is it worth upgrading to this one to just get the speed? I guess that's up to you, but yeah, uh, is what it is. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video though, and if you did, make sure to drop a like in the video, and of course hit that sub button down below. Make sure to check out Underdog Fantasy, use code ZERK. Follow me over on Twitter for USC Today, NBA Tomorrow, and I will let you guys know. Uh, you'll notice I don't have a special offers tab. I open them all up. That video is coming later today. If you guys enjoyed this video, check out these.